Y'all ready to hear some jokes? Look at me, I'm a black kid. I gotta tell you what it is to grow up like a black kid. Hey, Cheryl Lazar for What's Trending.com with Kevin Fredericks and Zay Zay, whose video, Growing Up Black, five-year-old comedian, has gotten hundreds of thousands of views on YouTube. So what was the inspiration for this video? Whose idea was it? Mine. And so how did this video come to be then? Did you tell your dad the idea and then you, dad, you put together this whole script for him? Well, he said he wanted to be a comedian and he bugged me every day to make a video for like three days. So he sees me making videos and sees me performing. So I told him I would give him all the tools. I said, we'll make a video. I'll make you a Twitter and a Facebook and we'll record it and we'll see what happens. And I was thinking maybe a hundred people would view it and maybe you'll get a Facebook fan or two and three Twitter followers as a joke. And as you can see that I was completely wrong about that. By the way, my dad is like Joe Jackson with a little more love. L-O-V-E. Most kids want to be like their parents, and I'm, I just happen to be a comedian, and most you know, kids' parents aren't comedians, so that's probably why it's a little different. I wrote this stuff for him, mm -hmm. and I said, okay, Zay Zay, now say this. And he would just put his personality into it. You know, like I said, now say that's crazy, and he'd be like, crazy, you know, or whatever. So that, the personality you see is, is his. Sometimes people are like, you're trying to live your dream through him. I'm like, I have my own dream that's separate from his. Mm -hmm. You know, I just help my son be great at whatever he wants to do. And that's really all it was. And we didn't think this would be this much. You know, if I would have known it would have done this, I would have practiced harder or not edited so much or nothing. But, you know, it's just took a life of its own. It was just one little kid's dream, and I don't know, it just kind of touched people in the right way. Well, Zay Zay, I want to know what you thought of everyone watching this video and commenting on it and loving your performance. I think he's better than me. <laughs> he's very you? humble. He really is. He's a, he's a sweet, sweet kid. My other son, not so much. I have to ask you, as a dad, I mean, some of these jokes were pretty extreme, touching sure. um, definitely racial topics, some things that people would not be comfortable with, let alone a young boy of his age. All they do is beat us. All they do is whip, whip no matter what. I hate that. Hit me in time out. The kids in my school get time out. And I'm black, so I never get bruises. So what do you think about that? People reacting that way, thinking that this might be a bit inappropriate to have your child saying these things. I think that's a valid concern. And what I would say is I'm a comic first, mm -hmm. you know, with it from that point of view. I mean, I'm his dad. And I, I, I know I'm not like most parents. The way I approach life and parenting is very open, very, you know, straightforward we talk about race when he asked about Mar you know he asked about martin luther king he said why would you know somebody shot him why would they do that so i talked to zay zay very plain i don't just let him talk to me in any, you know any old kind of way but we talk about race he knows he's black i call him my little chocolate son and you know i love chocolate his mother's chocolate i say well, i just you guys are my two pieces of chocolate and as far as like talking about um race and black parents yell too much for the most part, that's Zay Zay's life. Mm -hmm. So it might be stereotypical, but we do yell a lot, you know? And he probably doesn't get nearly as many whoopings or hardly ever. He really doesn't get in trouble that much that it ever requires us spanking him or, or whooping him. But that's what a lot of black kids grow up like. Mm -hmm. So he does have those experiences. So people may not like it, but that's Isaiah's life, growing up black. I would say people have a valid concern, but it's all right. I think I'm doing a good job raising my son. Where does this go after this? Kevin? I think, um, well, it's interesting. It's really, I was telling my wife, it's hard to even fathom everything. You know, um, Zay Zay can act very well. If you feed him a line and tell him how to say it, he can say it. And you see him in some YouTube skits doing that. Um, he performing on stage live would be tough for a five-year-old to do. If he could pull it off, I would help him. Or he could might just make a lot of videos. I think he'd probably make videos, but I mean, he's getting interview requests. We're going to L.A. on Friday to, to do an interview, so I don't want to push him into anything he doesn't want to do. Me and my wife feel like when he gets older, he'll have something really cool to look back on, whether he does comedy or videos or he becomes an architect. Yeah. Then um, he'll have something really cool to look back on, like, hey, when I was five, I was an Internet sensation, and not many kids will be able to say that. Do the Dougie say they they want me to do it on the spot. If I don't dance, I get in trouble. It's crazy. Crazy, I say. For more of... What's trending online, just go to what's trending.com.